And we're back and I'm going to show you this time yet another hard collage which is a little bit different from one that I've shown you yesterday in my latest video. I've got a white background and this folder in which I've got a couple of images. You can find such images for free on Artsplash. Just follow the link in the description below. Open a new layer, go to the custom shape tool and select the heart shape. Hold shift while dragging a heart. Then press Ctrl A to select everything and position your heart horizontally and vertically in the center with the move to activate. Then go to view, show and grid. Activate the rectangle tool. We want to give our heart a stroke and a new color. Let's make it red. And now we create a new layer. We will simply call that rectangle. And now we will create our first rectangle. We want to have a white stroke, which is important. And, and let's just give it a blue fill color as well. The color doesn't really play a role. And now we can create these custom rectangles. If you want to resize them, just press Ctrl T. And I'm going to speed this up a little bit as I'm going to repeat the process a couple of times. So now we're done. Make sure to select all of your rectangle layers by having the first one selected, going to the last one, holding shift and clicking with the left button, then press Ctrl G to group them. I'll rename the folder to rectangles and then put the images folder inside of it. And now I'm going to create clipping masks for each image and rectangle. it to you for the first one. So I'm putting it above a rectangle, right click and then create clipping mask. So it is only applied to that specific rectangle. Second one, right click and clipping mask and there it is. I'm going to speed this up as there are a lot of rectangles and images. So alright, we are done now. Next thing we need to do is to resize and reposition our images. Go to each and every image, press Ctrl T and then resize them. Position them properly within the given rectangle. I'm going to speed this up one more time. It's always the same process. So now we're done, but maybe that doesn't look so perfect. So let's just add some more rectangles to have a better heart shape. So once again, go to view, show and grid. And we're simply going to add more rectangles right at the bottom and here on the top, two more. And I'm going to create clipping masks with images for these rectangles as well. And I'm going to resize and reposition it. Now we are officially done. It looks a bit better what we've done now. Let me close this folder and now we can make the heart invisible. We've got a heart shaped collage. What we can do as well is 
hold control and click on the hard layer and then apply a layer mask to our image folder that contains the images and the rectangles and now we've got this perfect hard shape can give it another background so this collage is a little bit different from the one we've done yesterday this one has frames for each image and the images they don't overlap so it's simply a variation maybe you like it better than the last one it's up to you what you use thanks for watching and i'll see you next time